Everything should be fine though, right? Like my hair's not gonna burn off. Hi hi, welcome back to my channel. Hi, hello, and welcome if you are new. I'm doing something with my hair today. That's why we're in the my bathroom. Not the bathroom, but my bathroom. And I have my makeup on already. But I'm going to be trying a new straightener. So mine, I don't know if it was myself or a small human who kind of like, I don't know the nice way to put this, but it's, it's, it's on its way out the door. It's, it's not, it's not performing like it used to. And I've had this same purple Revlon straightener probably, I want to say since I was like 12, 13, 14, 15. Like, not an adult, but like, older child kind of person, human, you know? You know. Um, so, had a bit of a breakdown, cried <laughs> when we were on vacation, and my super thoughtful partner was like, immediately, let me buy you a new straightener. Let me just go hook it up. I'll stop by the store, do your thing. They went to the store, they asked, what kind of straightener should I buy? Like, they don't really have hair, so it was kind of easy for the people inside the store to be like, let me help you. Tell me about your girlfriend. So, here I am with my hair, and it's not, it's not like, let me take out my thing. It's not in like bad shape, it's a little frizzy. Um, but we're kind of wavy, and if I want to just wear it down, I run into this kind of like messy on the ends, but like straight on top kind of thing. I don't, um, I don't know how to like nicely put it, but it's like a mess down here, like a nice mess. And then up here, it's kind of like frizzy, and however I sleep, I get little kinks in it, like you could see right here. So it's not, it's not absolutely awful, but I do want to straighten it to the best of my abilities. And that's what we're doing today. Well, that's what I'm doing today. That's why we're here. I'm going to be trying this new Chi straightener. What do you call yourself? A Termaline Ceramic Hairstyling Iron 1.5 inch. Limited two year warranty auto shut off, which is smart. International use, dual voltage, free thermal protection spray. Oh, a $7 value. Is that all in here? Like it's taped up, so I don't know how to go about this. Do I nicely put it back? Because I was told whether I use it or not, I have 30 days to decide and then return it if I don't want it. And at first it was like immediately return it because these are expensive. I don't know if you know. I'm going to put it in the description. They are of the pricey. So <laughs> immediately return it. But they were like, no, just try it. See if you like it. And I've been trying not to straighten my hair lately just because I'm like, I don't have my go-to, my normal straightener. So together, today, we're going to try this out. Bouncy Curls, Classic Wave, Silky Straight. So that's one of the things I'm worried about because it says 1.5 inch. So I'm like, are you... Mmm, fancy. Mind you, I haven't had a new straightener since, what, like 15 some years ago? Long time. Same Revlon straightener. I think I bought it at Target. It's still in my suitcase. I haven't unpacked it. This is the owner's manual before operating this is oh ooh, cutie I'm not using this today by the way but that's cool I didn't even see this like little heat styling thing I have this one here the IGK good behavior I love the way this makes my hair feel so I'm like why not and then here's the star for today in bubble wrap Woo! oh ooh. oh Immediately, that's a no. Oh, I'm not doing that. I don't. So I'm going to say right now, this design is flawed. 
um, why am I pinching myself in here? Like, what if I hold it down here? That, to me, that's a no. Why? Are we trying to be cute or are we trying to catch fingers oh, and hands? Ooh. Yeah. Well, lucky for me, we're trying this today. I'm putting that down to see if this is going to stick with me. Already it's a negative. I was nervous, but this is already a negative. This is kind of thick, so I'm like wide, I should say, not thick, but like wide. So I'm like, how do you make curls with my, my littler straightener? I do like this. It's like a Velcro wrap. And immediately, this is like pretty cool. But this is really long. Like if I want to be in here, that's cool. If I want to go out into the bedroom, that's cool. I think I can make it halfway down a hallway with one of this too. Like I'm, I'm not tall. I'm like 5'3 on a good day. And I'm holding it with my foot. So this is like a 10 foot cord. Probably less. But... So I plugged it in. Oh, that's weird. Why are the power settings like inside here? So it says power. Automatically turns on at 370, which is good. I don't like to take it too high. My other, oh, immediately hot. Oh gosh. My other straightener took a minute to heat up, but it was like digital so you can change it. On this one, I don't know how well you can see where it's flashing. <laughs> There's 410, 390, 370, 350, and 330, and that's it. And then power. And I guess you could just press the up, down, and change it between those one, two, three, four, five. And it's blinking now, so I'm assuming that means it's heating up, but that was really hot. So I'm going to put it there. Oh, it's done. It's done blinking. That's really quick. Pros and cons. Don't get, try not to get ahead of myself. I'm gonna come in with this. Spray it up. I'm opening the door. <laughs> okay, so here's what my hair looks like. We're just brushing through. I'm the nervous. Let's start with this section here. And just go for it. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so far, not bad. It was really hot. I should not have worn. I shouldn't have worn my workout shirt. I should have worn a t-shirt with this. Oh my gosh. So it looks okay. We're not terribly bad. We're still. Looking good, at least comparing the two. It looks nice. Normally when I'm done with this section, I'll come to the back and then straighten it out. I don't know if you've seen my previous straighten videos, straightener, straightened hair videos. So let me do this other side and then I'll do them both in the back so I don't get that little bump. So 
so so far so good I am kind of scared to get it too close to like my neck so like these little baby hairs right here I don't think I'm gonna touch but overall we're doing okie dokie I feel like it's pretty nice I don't <laughs> I'm gonna say this now I don't like how this plastic is or how plastic feels it feels really cheap and I know this is not a cheap item but my Revlon felt like the plastic was heavier, more durable, more solid. I feel like if I, like if the heat wasn't on, but like I went like this and like went to bend it, it would bend, probably snap. So I just a little flower. Um, I'm going to move through with the rest of my hair. Hopefully speed this up for you because I have a lot of hair. But we're just, I'm going to eat some, mm, try to do it good. Yeah, fingers What do we think? I feel like a boss little bee right now. I like it. One thing, I mean, one thing I forgot to do on this side. And I usually do this with my fingers, but I was nervous. They come in with these cute little baby or baby hairs. Straighten them. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. This side I think I got okay. Oh, under here. No. Because my widow peak, widow's peak. Better? Better. I wonder if it's going to auto shut off too. I think I got the back okay. When I straighten my hair, I like to do the crisscross as I'm straightening the back so that way it flows and stays to the back. Definitely not a ton of volume, but that's okay. That's what I'm going for. Not a lot of volume. Straight. So it's not, it's not that bad. I, <laughs> I think it did a pretty good job. I did have to go with smaller sections. I don't know why I was trying to go with like bigger sections there at the beginning. I got a little oily or a little more oily. Can you tell? <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't have to put my hair behind my ear because it's, Great and gorgeous. I think it did a pretty good job. And my hair didn't burn, so like win win. Look at this straight. Doesn't want to stick to my face. We're just like. 
Um, one thing, and I left this on because I want to see how long it takes to auto off. Um, remember how in the beginning I was like, this is such a weird design. It like pinched me. Why would they do that? What if they pinch me here? Not like I'm going to hold it down here while I'm straightening my hair. But these heat up all the way around to like here. So I can't put my hand up here or else my little fingers are going to be... And that's really wide. So I have my hand down here. It's pinching my little fat. <laughs> like my, the pad of my hand, my palm. Make them an animal. The palm of my hand with the little fat, it pinches it. I don't, I do not like that. Mm -mm. Um, I haven't tried curls. Maybe I'll try curls. Not, ugh, not tomorrow. I want to see how long this will go for maybe like a couple days later but I mean that's really the only thing I don't like about it the thickness doesn't make it a yes or a no for me or the width it doesn't make it a yes or a no for me that extra half inch I would like it if this was longer that would be not I'm pretty sure my Revlon is a little bit longer this just seems kind of stubby, maybe because it's wider, but I feel like it should be longer. Because, I mean, like, if you're wider because you have more hair, shouldn't you want to make the heating thing longer as well as wider? Curious. Um, I'm going to go out right now. Go to dinner. See how well this does. Not like it shouldn't do well, because, I mean... Well, you know what? I don't know what I mean because I've had the same straightener my whole life. I've only used that one straightener. Like, my stylist used different straighteners, but she's a magician. She can do anything with those things. It took me a while to learn to curl with my straightener. So, refer back to my straightener with curl curl straightener video. I'm pretty sure since this is a hair video, I'm going to add it into my hair playlist. So, you can just go watch the video in there and the other videos in there. But it's not a bad thing. Really against change. Not a big fan. But I mean, so far, so good. I'm just going to continue on with my day. Probably add a little bit of powder since I got a little workout going there. It's been a hot minute since I've straightened my hair. So I'm going to do that and go have dinner. If you guys have any like tips, tricks for this little spicy doodle, like or recommendations on good straighteners in case this one doesn't make it um I'm not I don't like immediately know because of this feature right here and I just know it's gonna it's gonna aggravate me later down the line and I'm not about that this hasn't turned off yet I don't know when it turns off maybe I should like not touch it and then it turns off but I'm not like just the girl who like turns it off I turn it off and unplug it yeah I don't trust me. I don't take any chances. Anywho, helpful information down in the comments. I'm going to go. Thanks for watching. Bye.